If I had a million dollars, I could make anyone fall in love with me. Anyone. Or just the person that I really want. Keep watching to find out what that has to do with today's book. Hey y'all, this is video number six of Vlogmas 2022 on Kyla's Reading Day. I'm Kyla Denango and today we are discussing one of my favorite series of all time. We're discussing the book, Sleeping With Strangers. So this book is written by Eric Drum Dickey. The genre of the book is fiction. The theme of the book is suspense thriller. For Vlogmas 2022, I'm going through 12 books written by Eric Drum Dickey. And so Sleeping With Strangers is the first book in the Gideon series. I'm gonna get a little blurry here because the camera is trying to compete. Sleeping With Strangers, Waking With Enemies, Dying for Revenge, Resurrecting Midnight, and then Finding Gideon, okay? And now, so the most important thing about the book to me is Gideon's interaction with these squares. <laughs> for one, it's the designation of them as being squares because they're not con men, con women in the wet work business. For one, it starts off with Gideon and you find out that he's on an airplane headed somewhere. He runs into a woman who's crying on the plane the entire flight to London. And you also run into someone else who we find out is Lola Mack. Now, Eric Jerome Dickey does a really good job of intertwining, intermingling his characters. So we learn that the woman who's crying the entire time ends up being Mrs. Jones. Mrs. Jones is actually the mother of a character in a prior book. And the book, the daughter Mo gets into some trouble and you find out that her parents are going through a divorce. And then you find out that Mrs. Jones is the same person and it's, he loves to intermingle, intertwine his characters. So it's really important that you get to see Gideon interacting with these people because they're just like, what if, what if I was sitting next to a killer on a plane, right? Like it just gets your mind going and going and wondering, right? The thing I love about the book is the part where Lola Mack is walking around and she can't wait to see her boyfriend. She can't wait to see him, can't wait to see him, right? He's in the play ranch, can't wait to see him. So she meets Gideon and she's humming all these songs which mean nothing to him. 525,600 minutes, if you know what that's from. So there's all these references to these songs and they mean nothing to Gideon, right? He's a contract killer. He gets a job, he goes out, he takes care of it, he goes back home or to wherever. So Gideon learns about how to get into the wet work industry because he wants a million dollars. The girl of his dreams said that he cannot even take her out until he has a million dollars, okay? We'll talk about high standards a million dollars and so that is his entire goal he's working he's working he's saving up money he wants this million dollars and so it's like he's just the boy with a crush trying to get his crush to go out with him trying to do all the little silly things that she wants for you to go out with him can you believe that <laughs> it's so cute what i love about the series is that eric drum dickey humanizes a contract killer. I never thought I would say that sentence, <laughs> never. And one of the things I love about Eric Jerome Dickey is that I like to read his acknowledgements where he writes about where he was, what was happening during this time of the final review and when he's hitting submit or publish. And it's great to think of his creativity of him just being in a hotel room writing and one of his prior characters jumps out and they're like, I can't believe you only had me in that book four years ago. When do I get another chance, right? So when I reread the book, Sleeping With Strangers, yes, it is your first introduction to Gideon. It gets you right into the Gideon series, which is five books, but I like to think they're six. <laughs> Thieves Paradise, Sleeping With Strangers, Waking With Enemies, which is tomorrow, <laughs> Dying For Revenge, Resurrecting Midnight, and then Finding Gideon, okay? So we are going to go through all of those books with exception to Thieves Paradise. I won't give up the entire plots. These books are big, right? So thank you for hanging out with me as we continue to go through novels by Eric Jerome Dickey as a part of Vlogmas 2022. Okay, I'm having so much fun reading all these books for Kyla's reading day and releasing these videos to you every single day for the 12 days leading up to Christmas, okay? So let me know, have you read this book? Have you read the series? The Gideon series is really, really great. So thank you for hanging out with me as I reviewed another book by Eric Jerome Dickey. 
Hope you're getting ready for Christmas and I will see you tomorrow with another video of Kyla's reading day. <laughs> Bye.